What it bees? What up, YouTube? 13 Love. Today's topic is uh, sodium fluoride. We'll be talking about sodium fluoride today. And what exactly is sodium fluoride? What is that, though? What is that What poison? is sodium fluoride? It's, a, it's in all our toothpaste, our water supply. What is this stuff that just seems to be popping up out of everywhere? I guess it's really, really healthy for your teeth. Real healthy. According to dentists. And that's why it's in... Look at that, look at that, look at that Colgate, baby. Mmm. Yep. Mmm. Look at that sodium fluoride, 0.24%, baby. Anti-cavity. Mm. <laughs> yeah, sodium fluoride is found in all major toothpaste companies like Colgate, Crest. All the pretty much number one dentist recommended toothpaste have sodium fluoride in them. Fluoride ruins your teeth. No joke, no joke. Ruins your teeth, has no benefits for your teeth. It only has negative effects on your brain and your pineal gland, which controls dreams, sleep cycles, and melatonin in your body. Go do your research on your pineal gland so if, if you, you have Yeah, it. if you don't, can't remember your dreams, you're probably using sodium fluoride daily. Mm-hmm. Blocking, blocking your, your connection to the spiritual world off with that fluoride. Uh, Not only is it found in toothpaste, sodium fluoride is also found in waters. Major water companies like Aquafina, Dasani, Fiji Water. A lot of these water bottles out here, man, they be having ingredient lists. Did you just say Fiji? Yeah, Fiji. 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 These niggas trying to kill your ass. <laughs> Promoting healthy waters, man. Why waters got to have ingredients? Check out ingredient this water. List. Walmart water. <laughs> water. Look at that little ingredient list right there. Bam. All right, wrong one. Right there. Bam. You see that potassium chloride? Potassium chloride. Ingredients Is that the stuff they use in death row? I think so. That's the stuff they use in death row when they're about to sleep you. When you're about to die, mm. they inject you with potassium chloride. Stop That's your exactly heart. exactly what's in the water. Hey, this goes to show. And look how many young people we got dying out of nowhere. Hey, it's what you put in your body. Alzheimer's, rocketing, mm. all-time high. Over 400% in Alzheimer's in the past 10 years. But hey, it People ain't. Love it. People it, love that Gatorade. <laughs> you love your beer. You, you love, love your GMO beers. You just love that GMO soda, don't you? Anything that doesn't have purified water in it is poisoning you with fluoride. But it tastes good, baby. <laughs> mm. You already know. Turn up. Mm. Fire, baby, fire. A little history on um, sodium fluoride. If you look at it, everybody knows Hitler used it and everything to docile people and all that. Just a little history you find out for yourself. Hitler used it to control the Jews to make them more docile. And guess what? Our government's doing the same thing. They're putting it in on all tap waters, all commercial water, toothpaste companies, and they're promoting that. That's what they're promoting, the sodium fluoride. Sodium fluoride makes you not care. Look at everybody, what they say. I don't care. I don't care. Uh, the feds just lost a trillion dollars. I don't care. Hey, you're a human resource. Your birth certificate is being sold. You're nothing but a straw man. I don't care. They go to fast food places. They have warnings that say this food will cause cancer. And they still eat it. Why? They don't care. It Something good. in their brain isn't clicking. It's not clicking. It's not letting them put that together. There's blockage in their brain. Apparently. A person with a healthy brain would not eat something that's going to kill him. And it says on a warning label, causes cancer. Come on. This toothpaste says call poison control. But guess what? People still using it daily. They're putting it in their mouth daily, absorbed straight to the brain, straight to the pineal gland. You got parents giving them their kids this type of toothpaste and some fluoride yeah. rinse. Especially if you have kids. Don't let your Ooh. kids use that kind of toothpaste. Especially if they're developing at a young age, their brain's still developing, they're still maturing. How are you going to poison them like that? It says poison control. It's, it has a warning. You don't let kids do that. Especially youngins. I don't think you got a brain if you're giving your little baby nursery water with fluoride in it. You got to be out your mind. But it strengthens their teeth. Oh. <laughs> oh. But if you're looking for you alternative brands, uh, this is a good one right here. They use very, very good ingredients. Locally made in California. Good thing I'm in California, baby. And uh, here's a good rinse. Organic. Mm-hmm. Tom's is way better than the fluoride, but Tom's 
has been bought out. And you got to understand that toothpaste companies and the dentists all have a um, system going. So, you know, a lot of toothpastes actually weaken your teeth. So you go to the dentist. They drill your ass up, which is totally unnatural. Fill you with some mercury. That mercury. Mm. Mercury fillings, though. Send you on your way. Yeah. But did you know your teeth can regrow? Ooh. Yeah, most of the den- most of the dentists recommended toothpaste. They all destroy the the first layer that that rebuilds enamel on its own. So you have to go to the dentist. You have to have work done. You destroyed your own teeth using that fluoride, using the GMO toothpaste. Very good system. Very good. Fluoride just affects you in so many ways. And the thing about fluoride is you don't have to believe anything I'm telling you or he's telling you. You don't have to believe any of this. Go out and do your own research. Look this up on your own. That's how we did it. Mm-hmm. And then you got people say, oh, no one told us about fluoride, not even in school. The Never Everman. did they tell us about sodium fluoride and how it affects the brain. We had to do that on our own. They were actually trying to give us fluoride as kids in schools. Remember this. Remember when we were in little schools and they used to come with those trucks? You need your fluoride, buddy. Fluoride pills, fluoride. <laughs> Just to make you docile, make you not remember who you are. Get you trapped. Here's some good waters you could be drinking. This is Castle Rock water from uh, Mount Shasta, California, local water. It's uh, naturally occurring minerals and it's alkaline. It's high frequency water, but only thing bad about that is that they're spraying chemtrails daily over Mount Shasta, so it, you know it could have a lot of aluminum in the water, a lot of barium, but at least you're not drinking sodium fluoride. You got to be aware of what you put into your body. You just can't be open-minded. It's just food. It's just drink I'm going to put into my body. We don't live in that type of world anymore. It's changing. You got to change yourself. If not, you're going to perish. Yeah. The best water to drink, in my opinion, is uh, distilled water because it it removes inorganic materials from the from your body and your brain. Mineral deposits that store up from heavy metals that they're spraying, that you're breathing in daily. Distilled water removes that. It helps cleanse cleanse the body and the brain. Man, don't believe those trolls that be going on videos saying distilled water is bad for you. It leaches um, materials, minerals from your body. Yeah, minerals and vitamins. It only leaches inorganic materials. It only leaches inorganic materials and minerals. Oh, we fucked up there. But <laughs> They're trying to tell you. It's funny, this, the info they try to tell you, the disinfo, the, and all the info that's out there. You really got to check your resources and listen to your inner self. If it resonates with you, it resonates. Go with the inside. And don't forget your lemons on the water. Lemons. Oh, yeah, lemon water. Helps alkaline the water because, you know, distilled water is at a 5.6 on the pH scale. It's slightly acidic, but if you add lemons, yes, people say lemons are acidic. They are, but as soon as they enter your body, they become alkaline. So when you drink the lemon water, it alkalines your body. It helps alkaline your cells, your brain, everything. Hydrates even faster. And don't forget about the seeds, buddy. The seeds. Yeah. Make sure your lemons have seeds. Stay away from that fluoride. Yeah, just watch out. Stay away from fluoride. Stop brushing with so- fluoride daily. Stop taking long showers, especially hot, steamy showers. Ooh. People be taking hot, steamy showers daily, breathing in the sodium fluoride, (gasps) absorbing it straight to the skin, straight to the brain. Anything you put on your skin is absorbed 90 times faster than if you were to drink it. So when you're taking those showers daily, you're absorbing fluoride 10 times faster or 10 times more than if you were to just drink it. We're not saying don't shower. Shower. You got to shower. But think of your body as a sponge. Try to minimize the water you absorb. You know, you could even just get purify water in a tub and wash yourself down with that every day three times a day or whatever how many times you like taking a bath but limit your fluoride exposure it's all up to you no one else is going to do it it's all up to you oh, oh wait 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 before i forget fluoride and chemtrails they sleeping with each other baby <laughs> they sleeping yep. fluoride makes you attract more aluminum and guess what they're spraying daily over us aluminum and barium so you're just absorbing more heavy metals. If you're taking in fluoride daily, you're absorbing a lot of heavy metals. And your brain is probably clogged up and you can't remember your dreams. You can't, you probably can't even remember what you did three days ago. It's that sodium fluoride. 
giving people know. Alzheimer's. But you know, you don't have to believe us. Go out and do your own research. Anyways, it's 13 Love coming from uh, Young Vibing over here. We vibing high all the time. We vibing. We consciously vibing every day. Just preaching to our people, making sure they wake up. It's time. It's time to wake up. Thirteen yeah. Love from you and yours. Love.